Hello Pisces, this is Wendy. Welcome to my channel, Wendy's Tarot. In this video, we're going to go ahead and ask the cards, what are your person's feelings for the third party? What are your person's feelings for the third party? Now, when I say third party, I'm meaning um, whoever it is that your person is involved with besides you. Now, if you know your person is not involved with anyone, and if you know that there is no third party, then this reading is not going to be for you. However, if you are Pisces, who knows that your person is still involved or still connecting with a third party, or you suspect it, or maybe you just have reason to believe that it is true, then this reading is going to be for you. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's see. What are your person's feelings for the third party? All right, Pisces, first card we have here is the Five of Swords in reverse, the King of Pentacles upright, the Two of Swords in reverse, the Two of Wands in reverse, the Seven of Wands upright, and the Five of Pentacles upright. At the bottom of the deck, we have Temperance card in reverse. Hmm. I don't feel like I don't feel like there's much communication happening between your person and the third party. Hmm, let me see. Wow, so there was a big argument here between them. There was a big fight, a big argument, a big separation. I feel like somebody blocked the other person here with the Seven of Wands. Also, somebody abandoned the other person with the Five of Pentacles. It looks pretty ugly here in regards to their energy. Um, hmm. So, I don't know who blocked who, but... I feel like they're not in contact uh, or they're not in communication right now, okay? I do see that the Five of Swords in reverse, so there is unfinished business. Let's see who that King of Pentacles is. Tell me about this King of Pentacles spirit. Please clarify. We have the Four of Pentacles. And we have the Six of Wands. Okay, so someone's being really stubborn here. Either your person or the third party is giving the other person the cold shoulder. There's a lot of hostility here. There's a lot of um, animosity between them. Tell me about the Seven of Wands spirit. We have Eight of Swords in reverse. We have Six of Cups in reverse. Hmm, it's a little bit confusing. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles. We have Nine of Cups in reverse. And we have Two of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like somebody just kept repeating the same mistake over and over and over again. I feel like it's the third party. It could be either or, but I feel like it's the third party who kept repeating the same mistake over and over again and I feel like your person got tired of it got tired of the repetitive patterns sorry for the music by the way there's someone playing music outside one of my neighbors tell me about the five of swords spirit 
we have the magician in reverse okay that's manipulation and we have the ten of wands okay so someone got tired of the of the manipulation i feel like your third party was manipulating your person was constantly trying to manipulate them um feeding them false promises feeding your person false promises again it could be the other way around but i feel it like it's the third party um and i feel like your person was very um gullible in regards to this third party they were very gullible they easily were persuaded by them but I feel like your person is now in a place where they've learned their lesson and I feel like they're not going to repeat the same mistake again. So I feel like this energy of your person kind of shutting them out, okay? Anything else, Spirit? Tell me about the Two of Wands. Yeah, Six of, six of Swords. I feel like your person is moving away. They're deciding to cut ties, okay? Cut the ties with them. All right. That's what I see in regards to their feelings for the third party. Let's see, how do they feel about you, Pisces? Okay, I'm sorry for the music again. <clears throat> Spirit angels and guides, please show me, how does this person feel about Pisces? Whoever it is that Pisces is dealing with in love, connecting with in love how does this person feel about pisces Alright Pisces, first card in regards to how they feel about you. We have the Five of Pentacles in reverse. We have the Eight of Swords upright, the Six of Cups upright, the Lovers in reverse, the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, the Six of Pentacles in reverse, and at the bottom we have the Chariot. Ooh, the Page of Cups wanted to show itself here. Mm. I do feel like they want to return back to you, Pisces, here. They want to reconnect with you. But they are definitely overthinking things. They feel conflicted here. They're not really sure if they should return back to the past when it comes to you or if they should um, go, on, go, go their separate way because we do have the Nine of Pentacles here, which is the card of being single. So I do feel like your person is considering maybe staying single or being single. But it is a hard decision because I can see that they have feelings for you with the Page of Cups. So they are wanting to return back to you for that reason. They don't feel like it's completely over between you two. Even though I feel like there's a big separation between you two or a big disconnect here with the lovers in reverse. There, there's, there hasn't been commitment here. Um, the relationship has been really one-sided and I feel like they recognize that the one-sidedness came from them because I do sense um, an energy of them feeling guilty. Um, so yeah, it does, it does um, make it hard for them, this decision, because they don't want to lose you. So tell me about the Eight of Swords spirit. We have the Ten of Cups in reverse. What else? And we also have the Five of Swords in reverse. Yeah, it's this, again, this energy of wanting to return back with the Five of Swords in reverse. Part of them is scared also. They, they're scared that they have ruined their reputation with you. They've ruined their image with you. What is this Ten of Cups spirit? We have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, they, they're not sure if you two have a long-term future. 
you know, a part of them is doubting the potential of this relationship. They feel like there's too much damage or they feel like they've caused too much damage. Tell me about the Six of Cups. We have the Four of Wands and the Ten of Swords in reverse. Yeah, a part of them does want a relationship with you. But it's this kind of energy of, is it too late? You know, part of them might feel like maybe it's too late. What else, Spirit? Tell me about the Five of Pentacles, Nine of Wands, the Two of Wands in reverse. I feel like they're scared that you're not going to open the door for them to come in. And I think they wouldn't blame you because, again, I feel like they recognized where they messed up. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles here, Three of Swords in reverse. Yeah, this is a third party. They Maybe they went too far with the third party. They gave too much of their time and energy to the third party and they ruined their chances with you. Or at least that's how they feel. Ace of Pentacles, please. The Moon. Yeah, they're scared of what of what you'll say to them if they were to communicate with you. Eight of Cups and Two of Cups in reverse. Again, Eight of Cups and Two of Cups in reverse. They feel like it, it might be too late. They may feel like it might be too late and it would be a waste of time for them to try to make things work out between you two because like the trust, the trust has been broken. All right, since we do have the card of the Twin Flame here, um, the Lovers, I'm going to pick some cards from the Twin Flame in Separation Oracle deck. And we're going to see what messages would your person like to say to you. Spirit, Angels, and Guides, what messages would this person like to say to Pisces, please? Pisces first message we have here is I've committed to someone else because they don't challenge me I fantasize about getting a second chance with you letting you down was the worst decision I made I hid my true self from you because you challenged me to expand. Mm -hmm. I still feel your energy around me. I never believed in these things before. I do now. I wonder if you still think about me. How do you feel about me now that you've had time to reflect? Get one more. You were the love of my life. I didn't figure that out before. Before I know now that it's true. All right, Pisces, those were the messages. So I hope this reading resonated with you. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Take care.